Hi guys, and welcome back to another one of my reviews. Uh, kind of a mini sort of review, actually. I uh, just wanted to answer a few questions. Uh, yeah, I do know that I have no title. I will work on that eventually. Right now, I'm just kind of doing this for fun. Not really sure if I'm going to keep doing it or not. Just all kind of depends on how my mood goes, I guess. I just really wanted to see if my camera could do this and YouTube could do it. Um, you can find a lot better beer reviewers out there, which brings me to my second point. Yes, I realize I'm amateurish. You're not going to really see much editing on these videos. You're really not going to see a lot of background music or anything along those lines. Not until I'm more certain that I'm going to be doing more of these. So, bear with me, folks, if you don't like it. As for the mini review, um, this is both a mini review slash short review because I've already drank this a while ago. Um, not today, but, hmm, I'm actually debating if I really should do this, but I've watched the reviews from so many other beer reviewers about this on YouTube, uh, championing it as a great beer, uh, Beer Advocate thinks it's a great beer, I really hated it, and here it is, Rogue's Chocolate Stout, I cannot be more disappointed uh, basically, I can't get Young's Double Chocolate Stout in Canada anymore. Don't know why. Uh, this was basically reviewed in a lot of cases as a really good alternative to Young's Double Chocolate Stout. In some cases, people thought it was better. Uh, I've heard it described as chocolate milk, uh, excellent stout, very strong chocolate taste. Uh, this is also a beer that it is Sebi Bueller, a rogue original. Uh, ebony in color with a rich creamy head, an earthy flavor of open hops that gives way to a rich chocolate trouble finish. There was no chocolate to be found. I had no chocolate taste, nothing coming out of this. Um, if somebody can tell me if I've had a bad batch, that would be really helpful, guys. Otherwise, the kind of reason I'm doing this is I wanted to review this, and if I did right now, I'd have to give this a two. It was pretty bad. I had a couple of bottles, one I had cold, which I thought, okay, that's the problem, it is a dark beer, I should let it warm up, I let it warm up, still bad. So, anyway guys, let me know if there's something I've done wrong, maybe it's still the wrong temperature, or if it's just really a bad batch. Keep in mind that this is basically brewed at Newport, Oregon, Rogue Brewery, I'm on the east coast of Canada, they're on the west coast of the states, so, God only knows. Uh, yeah. Otherwise, feel free to check it out, guys, um, and anybody else that's here in Canada, because, you know, we don't get that many American beers up here, or at least we don't in these coasts, so feel free to check it out. Maybe it's just me that got a bad batch. I don't know. Uh, let me know, guys. Thanks. Have a good one.